Hi everybody, on this episode I visit Sensoji Temple which is one of Tokyo's most colorful and popular temples. If you like my videos, please don't forget to subscribe my channel and open notifications to be informed about new travel videos from all around the world. Sensoji, also known as Asakusa Kanon Temple, is a Buddhist temple located in Asakusa district. Tokyo's oldest temple and one of its most significant. Formerly associated with the Tendai sect of Buddhism, it became independent after Second World War. It is dedicated to Kanon, the Bodhisattva of Compassion, and is the most widely visited religious site in the world with over 30 million visitors annually. Adjacent to the temple is a five-story pagoda, the Asakusa Shinto Shrine, as well as many shops with traditional goods in Nakamise Dori. The temple has a titanium tiled roof that maintains the historic image but is stronger and lighter. Sensoji Temple is located in Asakusa district, which is on the northeast fringe of central Tokyo, at the eastern end of the Tokyo Metro Ginza Line subway, approximately one mile east of the major Ueno Railway subway interchange. It is central to the area colloquially referred to as a Shitamachi, which literally means low city, referring to the low elevation of this old part of Tokyo, on the banks of the Sumida River. As the name suggests, the area has a more traditionally Japanese atmosphere than some other neighborhoods in Tokyo do. Asakusa Station is on Tokyo Metro's Ginza Line, Toei Asakusa Line and Tobu Skytree Line. The boarding pier for the water bus is just a 3 minutes walk from Asakusa Station. From Haneda Airport, it is 50 minutes by train. From Narita Airport, it's 1 hour 25 minutes by train. From Shinjuku Station, take the JR Chuo Line to Kanda Station and transfer to Tokyo Metro Ginza Line for Asakusa Station. Travel time is around 35 minutes. From Tokyo Station, take the JR Yamanote Line to Kanda Station and transfer to the Tokyo Metro Ginza Line for Asakusa Station. Travel time is around 20 minutes. The temple is dedicated to the Bodhisattva Kanon. According to legend, a statue of Kanon was found in the Sumida River in 628 AD by two fishermen, brothers Hinokuma Hamanari and Hinokuma Takenari. The chef of their village, Hajinoru Nakamoto, recognized the sanctity of the statue and enshrined it by remodeling his own house into a small temple in Asakusa so that the villagers could worship Kanon. The first temple was founded in 645 AD, which makes it the oldest temple in Tokyo. In the early years of the Tokugawa Shogunate Tokugawa Ieyasu designed Sensoji as tutelary temple of the Togukawa clan. The Nishinomiya Inari Shrine is located within the presence of Sensoji and the Tori identifies the entry into the hallowed ground of the shrine. A bronze plaque on the gateway structure lists those who contributed to the construction of the Tori, which was erected in 1727. During the Second World War, the temple was bombed and destroyed during the 10 March air raid on Tokyo. It was rebuilt later and is a symbol of rebirth and peace to the Japanese people. In the courtyard, there is a tree that was hit by a bomb in the air raids and it had regrown in the husk of the old tree and is a similar symbol to the temple itself. Mm -hmm. 
Kamina Rimon is the first of two large entrance gates leading to Sensoji Temple. First built more than 1000 years ago, it is the symbol of Asakusa. The Nakamisa shopping street leads from Kaminarimon to the temple grounds. Asakusa Shrine, also known as Sanja Sama, was built during the Edo period and survived the air raids of 1945. The shrine's festival, the Sanja Matsuri, is one of the Tokyo's most spectacular and popular events. It's held every year on the weekend, Friday to Sunday in mid-May. Dempoin is a temple just next to the Sensoji, known for its beautiful garden. Unfortunately, the temple and the garden are not open to the public except during occasional special openings. Visiting the garden by appointment is not possible either anymore. Around the historical site, there are many picturesque buildings to visit and take photos. Nakamise Shopping Street is a small street connecting the front gate and the main hall of Sensoji Temple. This small street is full of local shops and food stalls and it's a great place to taste local flavor. Kapabashi Street is located between Asakusa and Ueno. It's an arcade dealing only with kitchen tools and fascinates chefs internationally. Tokyo Water Bus operates sightseeing ships from Asakusa Pier via Hamariku Garden to Hinode Pier where you can transfer to a ship to Odaiba. The Sumo District Ryogoku is located next to Asakusa and there are many sumo training rooms located in the area where guests can enter and watch wrestlers' morning practices. The Pleasant Park located along Sumida River offering scenic view of Tokyo's downtown area including Tokyo's Skytree. It's one of the best cherry blossom weaving spots in Tokyo. Sensoji Temple is usually open 6 a.m. to 5 p.m., but from October to March, opening time is 6.30 a.m. There is not any entrance fee to visit. Tokyo Skytree is a new must-visit place in Tokyo today. It is the new symbol of Tokyo and just 10 minutes driving distance away from Asakusa. And the tallest building of the country and the second in the world has been fascinating millions of tourists. As well as being Japan's oldest zoo, the Ueno Zoological Gardens or simply Ueno Zoo has achieved legendary status in Japan for its giant pandas and success at breeding them. The zoo is 10 minutes away from Asakusa by car. Besides the giant pandas, you will have the opportunity to see an extensive collection of animal species from Sumatran tigers to western gorillas, South American tapirs and polar bears. Akihabara is a buzzing shopping hub famed for its electronical retailers ranging from tiny stalls to vast department stores like Yodabashi Multimedia Akiba. Venues specializing in manga, anime and video games include Tokyo Anime Center for exhibits and souvenirs and Radio Kaikan is 10 floors of toys, trading cards and collectibles. Akihabara is 10 minutes driving distance away from Asakusa. The Nakamise shopping street stretches over approximately 250 meters from Kaminamiron to the main grounds of Sensoji Temple. It is lined by more than 50 shops which offer local specialities and the usual array of tourist souvenirs. Shin Nakamise or Niv Nakamise runs perpendicular to the Nakamise shopping street. 
It's a covered shopping arcade lined by various shops and restaurants. There are many restaurants in Asakusa where you can experience a variety of Japanese food. Apart from the most widely known sushi and sashimi dishes in the global world, we recommend you to try dishes such as yakitori, sukiyaki soup, ramen, Japanese barbecue, katsu, tonkatsu and curry rice which are popular throughout the country. In addition, you can easily find Italian or American cuisine such as pizza, pasta and burgers and franchise fast food restaurants around. As you can imagine, Senseju Temple is so popular that it gets super crowd quite easily, especially on weekends. But also on weekdays, the place can be full of people. In order to avoid crowds, we recommend that you go there early in the morning, preferably around 9 am. Also, one of the most beautiful aspects of Sensoji Temple is the night lights. You can watch the sun set over Sensoji Temple and the night lights turn on. If you are planning on coming to Tokyo, it is most likely that one of the places on your must-go list is Asakusa. It doesn't matter if it's your first time or fifth time to Tokyo. There is no other place where you will feel the whole Aido culture experience as much as Asakusa. You can be sure that it is one of the most worth visiting location in Tokyo. If you like my Sensoji Temple in Asakusa, Tokyo, Japan video, I would like to see your likes, comments and subscription to my channel for the new travel videos from all around the world. See you!